Okay, today guys we're doing Bob Seeger doing the fire inside and uh, this is that song that goes Okay, and this one has a lot of piano solo in it and on the website I do all of the piano solo stuff. There's two solos and I do both of them. This whole song is about five or it's about six minutes long and uh, there's a lot of piano solo stuff and I show you all the piano solo on the website. <laughs> so if you remember you can check that out. Um, right now I'm making the video so I don't know how many videos. It's probably going to be about, I don't know, around ten or so. Um, but this is the free part one I put on YouTube. Um, the rest of it's on webpianoteacher.com. You can find me on Facebook if you want to hire me to do a request for you. Um, just do a Facebook search for webpianoteacher.com. My Twitter name is webpianoteacher as well. Alright, enough of that. Let's get to this. Um, <clears throat> we're going to start with the beginning, the, the little uh, riff that goes... Um, so that's going to start with C, A flat, and E flat on the right hand. Left hand's an A flat octave. I just put one A flat, but let's do an octave. We're going to play that together. And then we're going to do this, which is E flat, below middle C. We're down here, below middle C in the right hand, and then up to A flat, B flat, middle C, B flat. A flat, B flat, okay? If we just play it straight, as simply as we can, one, two, three. Start playing that after count three, okay? Let's do it simply and then we'll try to embellish a little bit. One, two, three. Okay, and then we're going to have F, A flat, C. Left hand's going to be on a D flat octave this time. Okay, we get a, what's called a D flat major 7 chord, and then just the A flat by itself, and then play the A flat again, but add the F back, and then a single A flat. Now this is the bass that goes ba 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 okay? It's really evident in the bass guitar, ba 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 but uh, it's going to be D flat octave, E flat octave, F octave. If that's too difficult, just do a single note. It's fine to do single notes there, but you can do octaves. So the rhythm in doing it simple is one, two, three. So you go ba 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 three four All right one two and three ba 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 okay now to embellish it's really pointless to try to go through and show every little note that's played whenever this little riff is played throughout the whole song. Uh, what you want to do is learn this basic. Uh, skeleton right here and then learn how to, to improvise on a chord which all it is is playing the same thing that you play here but adding some rhythm to it okay and what that involves is playing more than just one octave in the left hand play the A flat and then keep it going sometimes playing it that way you know pinky and then thumb softer, you go It's kind of like playing the drums on the piano, you know. Now it seems stupid and weird to do that here on the keyboard, but that's really what it is. It's kind of just playing the drums on the keyboard. Oh, 
always think it's helpful for uh, a pianist who's trying to play by ear, uh, you know, playing rhythmic chords, behind, you know, over a, a melody or something, um, or under a melody, to take some drum lessons. Um, it's really helpful. Taking just some basic drum lessons, it'll really help you go far in that. Anyway, so we have this first thing that happens two times for the introduction, and then this is where the singing starts right here. Okay? So you do this two times, and then the singing's going to start right there. I'm just going to check my time on the video. Alright, doing great. I'm not going to sing this, okay? Uh, but I'm going to you know, show you the chords and what's being played on the, on the piano. And when we get here, it's not so much of a, you know, a solo piano thing, it's just kind of backing off while the vocals come in. But E flat, A flat, C, left hands on an A flat octave. Two, three, four. Then I have a little dash there, but it's four counts. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Alright? <clears throat> so E flat, A flat, C, and then we're going to go to F, A flat, C here. Same thing we have here, it's just not, uh, not all those extra notes, okay? And F flat, A flat on the left hand. that again and again this is where the singing starts ready go one two three four one two three okay and then I have an asterisk because I'm telling you to go back and play this again so that's what the asterisk asterisk means so let's go back and play this, this again already we're going to go up here and do this box right here just this one which is uh, almost oh actually I'm sorry no 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 you don't go back up there you do this again okay do this again all right so one two three four one two three four and then you do the asterisk again That'll be next. Alright, so let's do that. E flat, A flat, C, A flat on the left hand. One, two, three, four. Then we do this. It's the same chord, but just in a different way. A flat, E flat, A flat. Left hand on a D flat octave. One, two, three. Okay, ba bum. And then the asterisk. So let's come back out here and do this again. This starts at 47 seconds. So we'll start this at 47 seconds. Uh, and that'll have to be for lesson two because we don't have enough time here to do it. But uh, and this is still the ver this is still where the singing's going on. Okay. Um, so maybe you can pick that out if you're uh, trying to not on the website and you just want to try to pick the rest of that out. But let's go through what we've done so far. The first thing you do is the introduction, which is this two times. So let's do that. One, two, three. What comes up next is this. We'll do this in lesson two on the website, and then the other boards that have the uh, all the solo piano stuff on it. Hope you enjoy it.